This is an excerpt from the front side fundamentals bottom and top turn progression. It covers just one of the common mistakes that many riders struggle with. If you lose control during the top turn, with your front foot coming off the board, or the board sliding out from under you, you have too much weight on your back foot, obvious in some cases, and less so in others. So there are two reasons why you may be doing this. The first is straightforward. It's another case of your back foot not being far enough back. So you have to put all your weight over your back foot if you have any hope of burying the tail to carve the board. Remember your back foot being at the back of the board gives you far greater control with far less effort. The second reason is more subtle. Your weight may be well distributed as you head up the wave face, but you're then overly aggressive, putting too much weight too quickly over your back foot. This causes the board to really accelerate into a powerful turn, driven off the very tail of the board. But now all your weight is over the back part of the rail. You either find your front foot comes off the board, but even if it doesn't, you won't be able to keep enough weight on it to keep the full length of the rail engaged. So you lose resistance and the board slips out. You simply need to get more confident with having weight over your front foot right up until you're heading up the wave face. Keep your weight balanced between your feet and only come back slightly to your back foot to initiate the top turn. And remember that you want to be carving around the turn with weight over your back and front heels. So the full length of the board's rail is slicing through the water. Found this video helpful? It's just a small excerpt from the Front Side Fundamentals video, available now on the Progression Player app. Check out the full Progression kite surfing trailer or browse our playlist of kite surfing videos. Progression Kite Surfing. Learn to ride waves the right way.